Hello, everybody! My name is The Otaku Gamer, and welcome back to another horror playthrough! This one is on an indie type game, I guess you could say, called Leave the Room. Now, Leave the Room is a game I randomly found. I, I literally know nothing about this game, and you know, we haven't done a horror playthrough on this channel and since, uh, since that last one I did, which I don't remember the name of. Um, it was with the camera. Uh, it was kind of glitchy looking. and like blue dots and stuff. You guys know the name? Nah, I don't know the name. <laughs> it was some game I got recommended a while ago. Um, uh, but yeah, it was like uh, Exposure. That's what it was called, Exposure. Uh, this is Leave the Room, though. Exposure was a recommendation. This was not. This was something I found by myself. So we're going to test it out, guys, and uh, no music yet. It was made by someone named Xena. So uh, thanks, Xena, for making the game. Let's hope it's good. I wish I might critique it to death. Uh, just kidding. I don't do that. That's not a very nice thing to do. So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let us play Leave the Room. and let, Let's hope we can actually leave a room. If I do not leave a room before the end of this video, I have no idea how long it is, but I'm guessing it's going to be a shorter one. If I do not leave a room before the end of this video, I will be very disappointed. I just hope the creator knows that. <laughs> leave the room! Leave it, if you dare. <laughs> there was this new student in my high school. He kept looking at me weirdly. He gave me a bunch of books and told me, Teacher wants you to go and deliver them to Classroom 200B. It's a very specific number, 200B. I've never heard that before. And so I went there. Upon entering the room, I heard the sound of the key locking the door. Somebody had locking me in <laughs> Somebody had locking me inside. They were locking me inside. Oh, no. <laughs> Classic uh, grammar. Yay. Somebody had locked me inside. I know I shouldn't make fun of them because honestly, there were there was like this old fanfic uh, I used to write for my friend Zach, and it had really bad grammar, and he made fun of it in his video when he read my fanfic. So all things considered, I really shouldn't be making fun of other people's grammar. I know, but it's funny, so I'm gonna continue to do it. <laughs> yeah, hypocrisy. I know. Hey, everyone's a hypocrite, guys. So it's nothing new. Come on. This game is very quiet because there's literally no background music, so I don't even know why there was a background music option, but whatever. I screamed, but nobody came. And then came the night. Okay. Okay, first thing I'm noticing is, uh, interesting. I mean, it's not a bad looking game. It actually looks pretty cool. But I don't know, like, like the characters are, the character moves very slowly. Uh, it's kind of weird. But yeah, let's look at our inventory. We have nothing. Not a wallet. Nothing. 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 I can assume this was a French game because that looks like French to me. Um, let's let's save. Why not, guys? Notice how it says load, not save, but whatever. Leave the room, one man, 39 seconds in. Um, looks like all we got. Let, let's search around this room. Let's search. Search, my friends. Nothing of interest on the shelves, but there is some shiny thing on the top shelf. Well, why don't you freaking reach it? Why don't you freaking reach it? Oh, I love this. This freaking reminds me of like I can't remember what game it was. I think I think it was Mermaid Swamp that had this uh, feature. <laughs> kind of reminds me of Mermaid Swamp a little bit, because there was like a chair type thing you had to do. And, oh, we're not even close to the shelf. What the hell? It's literally like five feet away from the shelf, and yet the game says you are at the shelf. <laughs> yeah, no, you find a cell phone. Okay, I found a cell phone. But who's mine? The the, the the inhabitor of the room's cell phone? Moving boxes. Someone's moving, apparently. They are duct-taped. 
Okay. So yeah, this game reminds me a lot of a horror game I played and recorded a long time ago. I never actually uploaded, though. It was called, like, Yandere, I think. And it was similar in that, like, the, the character, m um, like, motions were a little off and stuff. And I don't know why. This game just feels a little slow to me. Like, I don't know why. Mm, it, it, it's, a, it, it's a minor critique, but it, just, just keep in mind, developer, if you ever watch this, it's a little slow. So if you could speak, if you could fix the speed, that'd be great. Imagine if it's the same person who made that Yandere game. <laughs> that would be funny, but I don't think it is. A skeleton used for anatomy classes. It has no head. Cause who needs a head, right? Or rather, its its head got a head. Yes, a garbage can. Excellent jokes, I know. Peek inside. Just watch it be a dead end. If I die, I'm gonna literally rage quit. So that's where I was! <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? Are you fri- How the fuck did you pull that off? Nothing of interest here. Seriously? That's a joke, right? It has no head. It's in the garbage. Yeah, we're aware it's in the freaking garbage can. What the fuck was that? That was the dumbest dead- That wasn't even a dead end. Forgive me. That was not a dead end, but that was- <laughs> That- <laughs> That wasn't executed very well. I'm sorry, but just- <laughs> It actually made me more angry than scared. Like, you know? A fire extinguisher. I hate to take it, but this game is not off to a very good start. <laughs> take it. The speed problems, the kind of la the overuse of jump scares. I mean, we're not even a freaking five minutes into this game, guys. I mean, come on. You get a fire extinguisher. Why are you mo Why are you walking so slow? Okay, it's walking e even slower than before. Am I going crazy? Worn out school books. Read. Sure. Yeah, really, the speed is kind of shitty. Not gonna lie. Unless it's doing that on purpose, and this guy's like a druggie or whatever. But other than that, nah, I can't see this flying. Sorry. Mathematics. In a quadratic, Q is not a vowel, guys. In is only used if there's a vowel. Like, in... In option. <laughs> in... A quadratic equation is an equation which can be written as ax to the second power plus bx plus c equals zero, where a is not zero. Okay, I, I, I didn't take quadratics, guys, so... I don't know! But whatever! Yeah, what's up with the speed here? Like, it's actually extremely slow. The door is locked, of course. At first, I thought it might have been my recording software, but it's not, guys. This game is just super slow. What the fuck? So, is this the entire game? Just leaving a room? Break down the window! Why not? You, you can literally do that. Okay, now you're moving fast. What the fuck, man? Okay. Game designer, why? <laughs> a locker. It's secured with a padlock. There is some sheet of paper jutting out. You get a transcript. Okay, let's look at our little frickin' transcript. Transcript of a history teacher. Well, 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 how does that help me, though? No, we don't have anything. Bad combination! You've got a bad combo! That's not the right one! It could have just said incorrect combo, but it said bad combo. Whatever. The window is jammed. So you can't break that one. Okay. Let's leave the room, guys. Are oh, you kidding me? You're seriously trying to tell me that we can't go out that window? That's freaking bull crap! And you know it! That's bull crap. It's probably one of these freaking oh history teacher history okay I get it the end of Vic the end of the Victorian era was marked by the death of Queen Victoria in 1901 her ray her ray her ray did she have a laser beam <laughs> lasted for 63 years and was one of the longest of the United Kingdom monarchy 
So 1901. That's probably what it is. You have a bad combo! <laughs> the locker's now open. <laughs> bad combo, burger! <laughs> Do I see it? <laughs> okay, I'm done. You find a glass bottle. Oh my freaking god. A glass bottle? What am I ever gonna do with that? Probably cut myself with it because screw this freaking world! <sighs> okay. Let's check it, guys. Let's let's check that shit out. Break the bottle! Why? Why would you I was joking, game. I don't know. I mean what would you even use it for, honestly? I don't even get this game, guys, if I'm just being honest with you, like... Uh, okay. There is no signal! It was recording a video when you found it. Ooh, let's watch it! Can't we... Watch the video?! You're seriously trying to tell me we can't use it. We got nothing else to do, let's break the bottle. You get glass shards. Okay, so that was obviously something we were supposed to do. Search. Oh, I get it. Okay. You get theater costumes. What? How is that going to help us? You got a theater costume. <laughs> What's that supposed to do? What, are you supposed to disguise as the enemy? I mean, what, what the frick? I... Don't get it, guys, actually. We got five costumes. What? Okay, I'm officially lost. Yep, don't get it. Trying to leave this room, but I really don't see how theater costumes are supposed to help us. Tear the costumes, I guess. <laughs> Oh, I get it. We leave with the... Yeah, yeah. Okay, I get what we're doing. You get shredded costumes. Oh, maybe, maybe, uh... Maybe we go out the window with the shredded costumes? No? Okay, never mind. That's it? I mean, just... What? Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Not the shred, not the shreds, not the shreds together in a rope. You craft a rope. Oh, uh, who goes there? No, leave. Freaking leave, you dumbass. Freaking leave. D d what's wrong with you? You could go outside. Is this dumbass motherfucker seriously gonna open the door before he leaves the freaking room? What is wrong? I'm gonna say it first because the dumbass. Like what the shit? Hi? I'm locked in. Somebody help me! <laughs> Bitch, who are you? You're still inside? I thought you were cleverer than that! <laughs> Even though it's not a freaking word, you dumbass bitch. I will have to deal with you! <laughs> Here comes the knife! What the freaking shit?! It's crying on the floor! What the fuck is wrong with you?! Oh my god. I'm just gonna wait in this room for the next 13 seconds. <laughs> and totally get fucking raped. I went to the police as soon as I got out! No wonder. When I told my story and what happened to me, they laughed in my face. <laughs> okay? I mean, whatever, guys. Whatever. This, this game's pretty fucking stupid, if I'm just being honest with you. <laughs> Without any evidence, I couldn't charge my kidnapper! <laughs> There's a fucking sound in my room. What the fuck? Is it 
Oh, I think it's a cat. Jesus fucking Christ. There was seriously like a, a knock outside my door, guys. And I frick, almost freaking lost it. Oh my god. Okay, that was actually... The, the, the scariest thing about this game was actually something that happened not in the game. Wow. It's pretty low. I mean, is this even supposed to be a horror game, honestly? I don't even think it is, honestly. It's, it's, it's like a, it's like a uh, leaving room simulator. Anyways, but then I remembered the cell phone and the video that was recorded. Yeah, you should check that, dumbass. Why didn't you show the police? So, so, wait, what? Rec oh, I get it. This is the video. Hello, my dear subscribers. Today, I'm testing my trap on a new lab rat. I hope he will be good. Wait, shake it. Shit, this is a YouTube video? Holy shit! It's YouTubeception! Dude, this is actually the coolest part of the entire game so far. I mean, it's not over yet, so hmm. I'm leaving the camera there, so it will record his exploits to get out of here. I think he will manage to make it out in a good time. I swear, if the main character's a fucking rat, I will lose my shit. Okay? He's not freaking rat! Well, talking to you is greed. Greed as in G-R-E-A-Z, like a g greed as in good read, but, but I need to go and get him now. Uh, okay, thank you to me more and more to subscribe to my channel and to like the series of Leave the Room. My name is the Otaku Gamer. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> and please subscribe. <laughs> okay. Uh, the student was arrested. His case was horrible. Numerous sequestrations even murders uh okay fa fame gone to his head i guess i don't know fame went to that kid's head man and all that recorded and uploaded to social networks well duh subscribers i mean come on man come on haven't you ever made a youtube channel good ending Leave the room scenario Zena English translation Daryl on creation tool RPG Maker MV <laughs> the plugins, the map graphics, the character graphics, and the There was music in this game? I didn't even freaking hear music. Whatever! Thank you for playing. Please visit xenagames.tumblr.com. That explains everything. <laughs> okay, I, in all fairness, okay, I, I can't knock it too much. It actually was a fairly functioning game. I'll bite very short. <gasps> to be continued. No, no, it's not. Come on. W what's what? What's the next one? Survive the room. <laughs> uh, <laughs> save the rat boy. <laughs> I mean, what? No, come on. No, no. There's no sequel. Come on. Screw that, man. No, <laughs> no. Okay, guys. This was leave the room, and this was like episode I think four of horror playthroughs on TOG. And I just gotta say that I was kind of disappointed with this game. Okay, let's talk about the good stuff first. Because I don't want to just freaking make the creator want to freaking kill herself or something. I, I don't want that, okay? I'm, so, I'm not trying to bash your game and ruin your life's goals and dreams or whatever. I'm not, but it's... I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to be like PewDiePie when he crashed that dead bear simulator guy. <laughs> I don't want that to happen to me. No, okay. I'm not. I'm not saying that. I'm. I'm going to be very, fairly, um, constructive about this. Um, but there's going to be a little bit of a rant too. So stick around if you love that stuff. Anyways, Leave the Room was a decent game. It was okay. It wasn't anything special though. Like, like, like nothing happened. I mean, who's the rat guy? Is the rat guy the narrator? Why was he in that room? Who's the person that was going to kill him? Was it the person who was making the videos? What happened to the person who was making the videos? Uh, uh, how'd they get there? <laughs> Red boy, the creator. How did I get here? <laughs> I I'm serious. I guys, I mean, th th this game, the plot was fucked up, okay? I and fucked up not in as, oh, that, was, that shit was scary. No, fucked up as in... HOW DID WE GET HERE?! That'd actually be a really great d title for the video! HOW DID WE GET HERE?! <laughs> That's a good question, and I, I still don't know the answer. Um, well, guys, uh, th th this is just one of those games where I, I really feel like 
I, I don't know why I played it. Like, it's okay. I mean, okay, l l let's go back to the positives. Let's, let's be constructive. Okay, constructive energies! It functioned! It was a functioning game, despite the speed. The speed was kind of glitchy, but we'll talk about that in a minute. I, I don't know, man. I did, this game just kind of didn't go anywhere. And I gotta give it a nice uh, 5 out of 10. It's really not that great. I don't recommend playing this game, guys, if I'm just being honest with you. It's okay. I mean... If it was a demo, maybe I'd give it a 6 or a 7, but it, 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 this looks like a fully functioning game. This looks like a, a released game, guys, so, uh, yeah, gotta, gotta give it a solid 5. It functioned, it did its job, it didn't overstay its welcome, I will say that. It, it knew that it wasn't going to be a long game, I mean, even the developers were like, yeah, this shit ain't gonna last very long, let's just, let's just make a quick little one, guys, come on! <laughs> Uh, yeah, it, it really, really, I'm re I was really disappointed in this game. I really expected more? I don't know, I mean, it's out of privacy. If I was on Game Show, by the way, check it out if, if you want. I, I don't recommend it, unless you want to rage, like hell. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. My name is The Otaku Gamer. And this was another episode of horror playthroughs. Many more to come towards the end of the year, and of course next year as well. We haven't, we didn't do too many this year, did we? Um, we only, did, we only did. Uh, this is the second one of 2018, and I did rather enjoy it. I mean, it was, it was a funny video. Uh, no, 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 not exactly the greatest game ever, but uh, hopefully you guys got some chuckles out of this little uh, indie horror game. Tonight, I do plan on recording another game, probably not a horror game, but something else, some, something better <laughs> than leave the room. <laughs> leave the room, guys, it's over. It's freaking over. <laughs> this is TLG signing out. I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Horror Playthroughs. Let me know what you thought about it down below. Like, share, uh, like, comment, share, and all the good shit down below. This is TLG signing out. Take care, everybody, and peace out. And remember... Some horror games just straight up don't deliver. And, you know, th not every game has to be a mad father, I know, but, I mean, he... It was good shit! Bye, guys! <laughs>